Hey there, I'm Michael. I'm Jen. And together we are... Wildly Graceful. And we're joined... By our daughter Hannah and our beautiful new granddaughter Isabella. Say hi, Ooh, Isabella. Isabella. Say hi. She was born, I thought. I thought she was a bear. Welcome to our toilet paper episode where we find out if you really need RV toilet paper and septic treatment or if they're just selling you more gimmicks. <laughs> Stay tuned for our home experiment. It's going to be fun. <laughs> Welcome back. We are um, in a bit of a science experiment, so we're in the kitchen, and we got rubber gloves and got uh, maybe not. Maybe we should have rubber gloves. Why would we need rubber gloves? What are you touching? I don't know. No, what are you touching? To get started, we're going to start off with a little apple juice. No, put it back. So we have five different brands of toilet paper, all RV slash septic system safe. Um, we got every different price range, luxury versus generic. Um, and then we have glasses with septic treatment that have been sitting for a little while. And then glasses without septic treatment. So we can see whether or not the toilet papers really do better with septic treated water or untreated water. And how each brand does. And our treatment that we're using, and again, there's just like there's a hundred brands of toilet paper out there. There's probably at least 50 brands of treatment. We did a lot of reviews, um, reading a lot of reviews, and we really didn't want our camper to smell like shit. Didn't want that. We also have a, a, a Michael, no- Michael, bad words. Oh, we have a no potty rule in our camper. If nope. we can try, to, if we can hold it. No pooping in the potty. No pooping in the potty. But sometimes it happens, and it's happened. <laughs> um, so we got, this was just what was most highly recommended. So what we're testing here with our controlled agent is TST Max uh, by Camco. It's an RV toilet treatment drop-ins. Um, we've used it on all our trips and we haven't had any issues. So no, we, no. I'd say we highly recommend this. There's a lot of these little suckers in here, you can see. Um, they're kind of cool. They're like dishwasher tablets. Don't use them. And they smell kind of citrusy. Limited fresh. <laughs> All right. Um, so I think Jen has a controlled experiment. Um, being being a uh, medical professional, she has far more biology than I do. <laughs> um, so I think we're. Uh, what's the hypothesis, Jen? Um, that the treated water will be do better with the septic paper than the untreated water. Awesome. Or is the gimmick? Is it a gimmick? Let's find out if it's a gimmick. All and right. then you'll get to see the various um, toilet papers dissolve. Um, the reason you really want this to dissolve, um, when you put just regular paper in, right, it gets wet and it gets, it, it clumps, essentially. And if that's just going straight down the sewer system into the large sewer pipes, there's water, there's pressure, and it moves it along the sewage treatment, and that's all fine. Um, Unless you have some weird rigged RV, uh, you don't have a sewage system connected to your RV. So it goes into your black water tank uh, and it just sits there and it fills with a little bit of water, black water. Um, and then when you're done camping and you go to, uh, to drain that, you want all that to come out. You want the everything in your you want Just all. solids and the liquids. Thank you. She put it very but nicely. But this, the treated is supposed to break down the solids. So let's find out if it breaks down toilet paper solids. So we're going to open each package. We're going to um, play with the toilet paper. Do one at a time. Yep. All right. So the first one is this one. Aquasoft. It is a two-ply safe for septic marine and RV use. I bought it on Amazon. It's a Thetford brand. Um, so what I did is I went out and I looked to see is it on Amazon and is it on Camping World? Because a lot of times people ask us, oh, should I get that on Amazon or should I buy the stuff at Camping World? 
um, you're going to see that again for this Thetford shop for this Thetford um, Aqua Soft. Dude, it is soft. Yeah. Um, it is sold on Amazon for eleven dollars and forty nine cents for a four pack. Has four and a half stars out of five with three thousand nine hundred and fourteen ratings. It's also sold at Camping World for five dollars and nineteen cents for four. So it's less than half what it is on Amazon. It's got 4.6 stars and 135 reviews. So, uh, all right. So here's the toilet paper for two ply. I kind of feel like it's really thin. It's we're gonna okay test soft. it. So we're gonna hold it with our teeth, and we're gonna, you know, no. Okay, we're gonna. Stop. We're gonna rip each, off. Not that. That has the glue on it. She broke it. We're gonna rip off each one of each square and put one in the treated. Only one square. And one in the untreated. Michael, no. And one in my pocket, just to see how it holds up in my pocket. Oh my god. Well, they look wet. Okay, well, it's going to take a few minutes. Do you ever poop and then drain your system? No. All right, the next one is Camco brand. Again, marine toilet and whatever, RV and marine toilet paper. This is called ultra soft, so we're about to see. It is one ply. One. I won't buy one ply. On Amazon, it retails for $6.65, so a lot cheaper than the other one. 4.3 out of five stars, 780 ratings, and at Camping World, again, way cheaper, $3.49. It is super thin. Super, super thin, and let's do the pull test. It's not very soft. Okay, okay, not bad. Went oh, for my pocket. Mine ripped. I'm gonna put it in my other pocket. I'm gonna run out of pockets by the time this right. is over. One in the treated, and one in. It's very. Don't thin. you all do that? Sometimes your nose is running because no. you were racing away from bears, and you gotta run into the bathroom and grab just a little bit of toilet paper. You shove it in your kind of. Sorry. All right, the next one is. Looks soft. Now this is impressive. Doesn't that look impressive? Luxury. It's got a little handle on the top with two little fingers. Like so I can like carry it. It's very fancy. Yellow. Um, so Lux Soft is a three ply. Retails on Amazon for fourteen ninety nine for six rolls. So um, it's the most expensive by far. It has four point four out of five ratings it's 148 ratings it's not available at camping world so you can only get this exclusively on amazon and it is rapid dissolving by 100 percent biodegradable exclusive rapid dissolving formula the texture on it looks very much like gauze so it's super thick so words matter to me everything that's paper is eventually biodegradable so unless you're putting plastic or something in here, they're all gonna be biodegradable. Okay, the top is softer than the underside. Yeah. Feel it. Yeah. It's, it's super really, soft though. It is though. super soft. And the, super thick. The underside, it's got a little texture to it that the top does not. So there's that one. Nice big roll. We're gonna do a pull test. Okay, pull it. Pull test. Okay. Oh, look that, at that. That had an interesting effect. So I get two and a half sheets. So I was trying to take it's that three. Three, three ply. It is three ply. Okay. One from my other pocket. Oh my gosh, I have to do all this? Okay. How much is that one? Did you already tell them? I did. Okay. I did. It's not cheap. Fourteen ninety nine. Alright. The next one. This one looks cheap. This is Thetford. So it's the same manufacturer as the first one. RV and marine toilet tissue. It's a four roll, one ply, snowy white. That's important. Toilet paper. It's important, snowy white. Yeah. In case you're in the snow. Your parts are so delicate. So it is um, on Amazon for $8.27. So compared to the other Thetford, it is uh, basically uh, $3 less per four pack. Oh, wow. It's four out of five stars. So it's one of our lowest rated out of all of them. You can see through it this. It is uh, 1,176 ratings. It does sell at Camping World for only $3.19. So 
So if you buy a Camping World, it is by far the cheapest toilet paper that you can buy. I don't know if you can see this, but you can see my fingers. That's how thin it is. And look how tiny this roll is. I'm just gonna hold this up, the luxury brand. It's like 99 cent store toilet paper. Compare. No offense, Bedford. Luxury, cheaper. I mean, you can just see the difference right there. And it's... Gonna do the pull test. It's not soft. This, this isn't gonna take any effort at all. Pull test. Yeah, that, that broke apart pretty quick. Ew, it's not um, soft. It is not. It is... Uh, it's rough. It's kind of abrasive. It's it feels like pocket. the kind of toilet paper you get at travel stops along the side of the... Free no, worse. Yeah, worse than Like that. the public park, maybe? Yeah. Porta potties. Porta potties. Porta potty Porta -potty. toilet paper. I love it. Okay, the last one I have, it's in my trailer, so I don't have a box and I was too lazy to go get it. So um, Michael printed me a copy. It's the Scott brand, um, two ply rapid dissolving RV and boat toilet paper from Walmart. I actually bought this at Walmart when we were getting our tra trailer. It's $7.97 on Walmart for eight rolls. That, that's a pretty good bargain. 4.3 out of 5 stars, 1,810 ratings. Um, on Amazon, it's $7.59. Uh, 4.4 stars out of 5, 502 ratings. It's what we currently have in our trailer right now. Um, it is one of, uh, other than the first one, it is the second highest rated uh, of the toilet Okay, papers. so look at this. This is the Aquasoft, and this is the Scott. They have the exact same paper. It's exactly oh, the same it's thing. It's the same print. Same exact print. The rolls are the same exact size. They're the same exact weave. I'm kind of curious now. Could it be? Is it the Could exact Scott same thing? Could Scott and Thetford be playing a trick on us? Do they okay. think us RV people aren't so smart wait, enough to figure them out? I want to see that one versus this out? one now. Can you hold that one out? Oh, we're gonna we're gonna do. Oh no, they're exactly the same. Even they're square size. Square size is the same, yeah. Wow. And they're super thin. Yeah, okay, we're gonna do the pull at the same time. Jindo move. Okay, that was weird. Hmm. This is the new one. So the Scott um, was a little stronger. It, it held a little bit longer. It gave me a little bit more. Um, I got like bonus, so I'm just gonna go down to one sheet so I can put it where? In my pocket. Does anybody else carry Kleenex in your pocket? I think that's an old person thing. Those of you that are in your 20s out there and RVing, you're probably like, why is that old dude putting stuff in his pocket? All right, so we're gonna agitate these for a little while and let them sit as well because your trailer both has activity when the toilet flushes, the water moves. When you walk around in your trailer, because you haven't watched our video on how to put those front stabilizer jacks <laughs> down yet, I mean, those of you are like, whoa! Okay, most of us lady folk probably don't like the trailer shift from side to side, but the big bears. Bears! <laughs> let's talk about bears. No, let's not talk about okay, bears. Okay, we're not talking about bears. Different All right, episode. so we're going to take a time out for a little bit, and we'll come back in a little bit and show you which one dissolved better. Oh, Stay tuned. Five minutes, ten minutes. Let's just wait you and see. You won't have any idea how long we actually no, wait. We could actually come back tomorrow and you wouldn't even know. You wouldn't know. All right, we'll be right back. The magic of video. Oh. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, hold on. boys. See, be right back. She's dreaming. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back. It's been about half an hour, maybe yeah. a little bit more. We had to feed probably the baby. like forty, probably like forty minutes. Um, and as you can tell, um, we have all kinds of little varying results. So what we thought we would do is we're going to kind of try to pull the piece of paper up out. We're going to do one at a time and, and kind of show you the difference. Overall, as I look at them, uh, my initial reaction is the ones on this end broke up way better way better than the ones on that end um, the ones in the chemicals broke up way more than the ones in the water except and for these two i kind of feel like they're slightly behind but they still dissolved regardless true they, these all still broke up 
this one looks whole. This one looks almost whole, this last one over here. And the other observation that I have is that all my wine glasses are in use and I had to put wine in my Yoda cup. That's the problems that you have when you conduct these types of experiments. I highly recommend Rampant Cabernet by Unruly. Anyway. If you want to sponsor us, go right ahead. That's right. It's All super right. tasty. So we're going to invite Hannah and the video camera over here so you guys can get an up close and personal look of what we're talking about before we start agitating them. And we will also pull out the clinic's pocket test. I've been playing with a baby for half an hour, so that is the piece of Kleenex, the first one. Piece of Kleenex for the second one. Wow, I really got, it's, it's kind of a mess. How did you know that which one is which? Oh, I had a system. I got a system. Oh, you're right, that is it. I'm right. I'm glad that's on video, do you hear that? I'm right. Oh, yes, you're right. Don't to touch my snack. I'm just right? validating that you're not making stuff up like usual. You mean you are the best storyteller I know. Have I told you the story about the bear and the RV? It's horrible toilet paper. Sorry, that bird RV marine toilet paper. You're terrible. But you do break up. All right. Here we go. I'm impressed. I'm impressed. She's impressed. I'm impressed. Apparently, I'm easily impressed. All right. She's impressed. Come on over, Hannah, with the video camera. Let's start with the Thetford Aquasoft. I'm gonna use this, I'm not gonna agitate it. Hannah, wanna come over here and take an overhead shot? This one? All right, I'm gonna pull up this. So that's an apple juice. This is solid. This has not dissolved at all. However, in the water, it's probably more dissolved than it is in the... I don't know, it looks a lot softer in the chemical. Okay. All right, the next one is the Camco RV Marine Tissue. It is... Well, it's kind of broken up. It's kind of broken up. Broken to okay. some pieces, hard to get out. That this is one is solid. So, cheaper probably means you need to actually use chemical. All right, let's move over to the Lux Soft. This one looks probably the most broke up of them all, and it is completely... Yeah, I can't get anything up with that. And then this one, wow, same. It's just pieces. There we go, like little. Bowl. And remember, that was the three ply. Yeah. So three ply. A hundred percent biodegradable. Super soft on your tushy. It was probably the softest. If it wasn't fifteen dollars for six rolls, I probably would buy it. Your tushy has value. I mean, girl parts are more sensitive than boy parts. Let's just say we are flowers. All right, and this is the Thetford, which I think is feels terrible. But I will say it did break up in the water without any treatment. And it did break up really well. Maybe it's, not. It's, yeah, it's, this one definitely needs agitation to break up. So the flushing of the toilet and the movement of the camper. So when and the bears are hitting the side of your trailer and rocking it, that's agitation. This last one is the Scott that we bought at Walmart. It's the four ply wrap dissolving and it actually did really quite dissolve in the water and in the septic treatment. So not bad. I think overall these three did by far the best in both water and in chemical treatment. So if you're I guess this, stuck and don't have chemical treatment, I guess go with one of these three. The sixth one is uh, is the unruly rampant. Uh, its bouquet is rather nice. Mm. Yeah, it broke up really well in my belly. All right, I'm gonna, let's rank them. So this would be my favorite. I One, think for, two, three. Yeah, I like that. Four and five. I'm gonna I'm gonna follow One, that. One, two, three, four, five. I'd I'd agree. Get this on camera too. I agree wow. with her. That's, yes. that's rare. High five. High five. Good job. I just think um, it's a little more pricey, but I, I cannot stress, and I know you can't, we're going to use feel -o vision There's no feel -o vision um, But this is so soft. It's just... It's literally 
love I would want to so blow my nose on this if I have a cold or something. Like this is softer than a Kleenex tissue. This is probably nicer than most tissue that we buy for our homes. It feels almost like a bed sheet or something. I yeah, mean, it's, it's really It literally feels soft. like linen. And you can see how thick it is. I mean, there's the three plies right there. Yeah, I'm going to try to put my finger through it. Right, I mean, I'm, that, that was hard. There was a lot of resistance to poke my <laughs> finger through that. Um, there, well, that, you know, that, well, that wasn't too bad. You know, the poke test, probably this one, this one, and then some of those, but um, really. I mean, you guys you get what you pay for. Yeah, Luxoft by Commodore. This is why I'm such an expensive keep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Siri also agrees. <laughs> That's Alexa. Uh, Alexa. You don't even yes. know your women's names. I don't. Alexa, stop. All right, kitchen dance off. Here we go. Um, all right, so Alexa, stop. <laughs> no woman in the house listens to Michael. <laughs> Not even Alexa. <laughs> It's me, the dog, and the bears. The dog's a female. <laughs> All right, well anyways. So there you have it. Um, Luxoft, again, uh, the Luxoft $14 was $14.99, but that's for six, uh, to be fair. So uh, if you break it down by rolls, it's- you $2 know, and yeah, some change. It's just kind of expensive, right? There's almost four packs here that are um, as much as that, but it really, uh, it, by far our favorite. So, Luxoff, Commodore, you get the wildly graceful thumbs up. Yep. Two thumbs up. Oh, two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. All right. Thanks for joining us. Subscribe. Like. See you, see you next time. Bye.